This was Blossom's house before we transformed it into her home and country store. I'm going to show you how we made some of the awesome stuff. For sneak peeks and behind the scenes of our videos, follow us on our Facebook page, Rosie's World. Today, I'm going to show you how to make Blossom's bed. Strawberry Shortcake likes it so much, she doesn't want to go home to her own bed. This bed is so easy to make. All the dolls could have their own bed. You'll need some of these mini wood blocks, these fancy craft sticks, you could use plain ones too, and these large craft sticks or wooden plant labels. The bed. Let's get a better look. It's really easy to make. You need three large craft sticks cut to the right length. It needs to be long enough for the doll that you're making the bed for. Each section will have two wooden blocks glued to each end. Start with the middle section. Make sure the blocks are centered. Next, the section to the left. The side that will butt up against the middle section, glue the wood block flush along the edge. The block next to it will protrude a little. Now for the section on the right. You do the opposite. I'm doing it this way because I don't want a big space between the three sections. It's not a big deal if you don't do it this way because the mattress will cover it up anyways. Next, glue the sections together. Now for the bed legs. One wooden block on each corner. The headboard and the footboard. The headboard posts are taller than the footboard post. Glue them on straight. Straight is very important. You can line them up to the bed legs. Now for the footboard post. Cut craft sticks to the right length from post to post. Glue them on straight. The markings on these craft sticks help. Space them out evenly. There, done. Mattress, blanket, and pillow. How easy was that? Let's put this bed in a bedroom. This room used to be Strawberry Shortcake's bathroom, but today it's a bedroom. I'll show you how to make a bed for a taller doll in another video. It's made a little different. This is so cute. Thanks for watching and see you again soon. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up. Check out this video. These are pumpkin lights that I covered with silk flowers. They're Chinese lanterns. I cut them open and wrap them around the bulbs. For the roof and sign, 
I twisted this wire vine with a string of LED micro lights. Don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.